Cabarrus County Schools announced this week it will not host proms or other dances this spring based on current COVID-19 restrictions. New tonight, WCNC Charlotte's Kendall Moore shares how this decision is impacting the local community. Prom is usually a night when students can dress up and look their best. Cabarrus County Schools decision to cancel prom this year affecting everyone from students to local small business owners. Chloe Flynn is shopping for her dream prom dress. So it's just so fun to come in here and see all the different styles people are coming up with and just try everything on. But this Mount Pleasant High senior found out this week she won't get to wear that gown at her school prom. It's just things like that are really important to girls and boys their senior year. So to take that away, it's it's really heartbreaking. Mackenzie so Fagger neons are really big. Owns year. dress neons. store Mackenzie Jades. So whenever the new rule came out, I was very upset because I was just thinking, you know, I bought all of these dresses for these specific girls with the hopes that they would come in and love the dress and love what they wear and remember it forever. With Cabarrus County Schools canceling its proms, she's seen girls now come in the store with home proms or small gatherings in mind. It's important that you get to do these things and live through it so that whenever you grow up, you can tell your kids about it and you can show them the pictures of the prom dresses that are probably really dated by then, but I don't know. I think that it's definitely something that they should still consider. A group of parents in Cabarrus County are still trying to give students a reason to dress up by organizing private events to serve as proms for several schools. And let's be honest, they've missed out on everything. And if it takes us doing a little bit of extra legwork to make sure some kids get a memory, we'll do it all day long. Parents and students working to find ways to make this evening filled with glitz and glamour still happen after everything they've all been through. The district says school teams are working to plan safe and fun spring events for students. No word at this time if those events will include a need for a formal dress. In Cabarrus County, Kendall Morris, WCNC Charlotte.